Hello everybody, welcome to my channel, Limitless Crypto, and today's video, I'm going to show you guys how to use the other NVIDIA, uh, the XMR NVIDIA miner to mine Bitcoin. And as you can see here, I'm back here again at Bitcoin.uk. I've been mining here for the past month now. I think it might be the month now. I got to double check again if, if it has been a month. And this is where I'm currently at. Again, as if you've seen all my other videos, I don't have too much hash rate going into it. What I have is just my GPU and my laptop that's mining Bitcoin at the moment. And this whole, this whole month might be a month now, uh, maybe a little less. I've mined a total of 8,125. And this is my pending balance. When it hits this, it's gonna roll into my total paid and my hash rate at the, at the current moment. So these are all the transaction fees, or more not not fees, but all the transaction that's been going to my my coin wallet. And I'll link a, a description below too on how to open one too if you don't know how to do it. So the, at the current rate, Bitcoin is it's about 0 0.00125 of the US dollar. So that's quarter of a penny, quarter of a penny. Maybe even less than a quarter of a penny, but this is where we're at. We are about 123 miners. There's zero pool fee, and it's, it's been going great with this miner. This is the to me honestly well, what my so far what I have. I believe this is a little bit better than uh, miner gate, but excuse me everybody. But let's let's continue on. So let's go to getting started. As you can see again, port 333 and port 777. So down here, I showed you how to use this one, the AMD. Uh, the This one I haven't played with yet. It's a little confusing for me, but I'll eventually figure it out. The Yam Miner, I, I don't I don't want to use the Yam Miner uh, because honestly, I found this one's actually a lot better. So, in, and it's even better than the uh, Claymore CPU Miner too as well. They both have the same 2% uh, dev fee. But my own opinion is that this will give you a better hash rate than the Claymore Miner. And down here, I'm gonna show you guys how to use this one right here, the XMR Miner. It's a, it's for only Nvidia uh, GPUs. This one's actually very quite simple to play with. Uh, it's not too hard. So let's get started. Click on GitHub. And down here, uh, you can see down here, and the I will put a certain file that's missing from this file too. There's actually one file that's missing from here before you, before you guys be able to run it. And let's click on cl right here and let's download as a zip. Ooh, I might have to download. Oh, I don't I have it. I do have WinR. Let's look it for me. Let's save the file. Hopefully, it downloads and it doesn't uh, give me a uh, virus thing. Okay, there it goes. So, once you get it done, if you can't find it, it's usually in your downloads. As you can see here, mine's right here and you could open it up and then extract it in here so the only thing that is missing from this this file here before we even get started is actually this this let's see was it this one no it was here it's missing this cuticle core file here so if you could if you I will, will give you a link to this miner right here that I'll, I'll, I'll create into my Gmail account, and you could you guys could download in from my uh, my uh, Google Drive. And so what you, what you need to do first is if you if you guys don't have it, it's, you can also download the Claymore Dual Miner. I'll give you a link to this part right here too, and you, all you just copy this code right here. So let's go copy and paste over here. And once that's done. You go and it says it says your XMR Easy Miner. This is where you go. You right click, click the edit button. This is where you edit. So if it's go back to the if you go back to the uh, bike Miner pool here, they give you the description here below here. So we have version the newer version, uh, 0.1, yep, 0.2.1 EX. So all we need to do is copy from this URL right here. Copy this and put it down and right there. Move this over. Copy this portion here too as well. I'll set this up for you guys already. So you guys just all you do is just really pretty much put your address in here. Space this out. 
and you could delete this portion here. I'm gonna go to my minor. Just come down here, copy this, and put my username right here. Password still X. This is the the part where you you could play with the the the, the B factor is is also you could set it up to A or you can set it up to six. If you read along here up here, it tells you what it does. So it says right here, see for REM greater value means more interactivity for your system but lower hash rate. So it's set to six, so you could set it to eight. And the, I mean the lower it is, the 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 more hash rate you get. You can also put a certain parameter too on here too. So you can see yes, it says set launch parameter and set launch password. And let's see. So the parameter you can also do the parameter as you can see here it says launch parameter is six by three. So it 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 it'll take a certain amount of blocks and certain amount of threads. Here I'll show you guys here. So let's say it was it was it. Let's see. Let's say this real quick. Let me put a pound sign here so that doesn't work. Was it? E and let's see this real quick. Close this out. Where's and minimize this portion right here. Go to this wallet and let's let's give it a run real quick. As you can see, it's starting. And it's running with my GPU. It's running at uh, 400 right here right now. But you can play with it. You see how it says using 60 blocks of eight threads. Let me close that out. And by when you set this part right here, copy this part right here. And space that, add that in there, and watch this. Let's uh, let's save this. Hopefully, I'm right. <laughs> it's been a while since I actually missed with this. I was messing with it the other day. So new blocks found. As you can see, there it goes. Uh, using three three blocks of 64 threads, and you see how it's got, it's gotten lower. So if you could just keep messing with this right here, so I could use um, instead of three blocks, and you can use let's say eight blocks and 64 threads. So let's see this real quick and start the miner again. And it it it'll change over time until you find like the the best one to use. And as you can see here, it's now it's it's a little bit better. But you just gotta keep playing with it, or you can just let the program run it by itself. But it's it's always best to tweak it and to until you get to the best one you, you want. So I'm just giving you a little overview of how it's set. Remember, I'll set everything here. You can always play around with the the launch part and the the exit in front of the threads. The one in the back is the block. So let's I'll show you guys again what I mean by that. So as you can see here, it, it says there are eight blocks of 64 threads. And this is a this is actually a very very easy version to to run. The XMR miner is, is very easy to set up. And here he goes. This is how it is. I I will upload this into my Google Drive. You you could download it. And remember to to always change your address. I mean you can buy it for me, but always change your address. So let's read through here a little bit. If you guys need any help, let me know, and I I will do my best to provide you guys the necessary answers. Just email me or give, leave me a comment below. And we'll, we'll go from there. If you, you, when you have more GPUs, you you could always mess with it, and it'll try to provide you with an, the the best results. I will provide you with a web page too, is if I, if I still remember it, I'm, I'm how, of how to tweak it. So if if I don't, then I'll try to find it and post it on onto the video later on. And and that's this is pretty much it, everybody. Uh, this is actually a very very easy uh, software to use. Just remember that you have to get this program in order for the XMR miner to mine. If you don't, and you download straight from just straight from Bitcoin on here, the the program won't run at all. Here, I'll give you an example here, real quick. So let's open up over here, and let's go to my downloads. I'll just extract it here real quick. 
as you can see, when I start it, it this is what it does. Because it's missing this portion of it. So that's how you that's how you get the file. I found this by playing with Claimer Miner and, and found that Claimer Miner actually has the same uh, file right here and it works just fine. Well, that's it. I hope if you guys enjoy, please like and please subscribe. And I'll be doing more videos along the way too. I will give you guys updates on my my Bitcoin mining and also as my Yubi coin. Actually, let me pull that up real quick. Um, I know this portion of the wallet, my wallet takes forever to load. And but let's go here real quick. So I've been I've been I'll do some video updates on, on this. So I've changed my pool to a different pool because. Uh, if you can see here, this one gives you six percent. I mean, they're taking six percent, and including the claim reminder, that's a total seven percent. That's a high percentage. So I jump to a pool, to a different pool. I'll do an update video of, of everything uh, of so far with, with my Yubi uh, account and so forth, and how how to get a starter and get in mining too as well. So these are the two ones I'm doing. One is the Bitcoin, the other one is Yubi at, at, at the moment. I only have um, three GPUs at the moment mining them, so. Uh, it's still launching, but I'll do another video and show you where I'm at with, with uh, Ubic, and we'll go more. But if you guys have any questions, concerns about this XMR miner for mining Bitcoin, let me know because Bitcoin and Monero are two different things, just different platforms. And well, I wouldn't say different platforms, just uh, different ownership of certain things and certain ideas. And so, all right, all right, everybody. Hope you enjoyed the video. And like I said again, please uh, subscribe and like. Comment below if you think this video is bad. Let me know. How can I improve it? Thanks, everybody. Have a good one.